Hey everyone, welcome, welcome back here to my channel where I play Planet Zoo. My name is Nisa and today we are looking at the Saltwater Crocodile Remaster and New Variants mod for Planet Zoo made by Gaboy, Mega Gaming Rex, Bobsu and Norwhaler. I actually thought Leaf also were in this, but uh, yeah, only four models. I thought there were more actually. Um, but that is a lot for a remaster, but uh, let's see what they've been working on. Uh, again, the picture here below me is from Superpedia. It's the original one um, that you have in your game if you don't have a remaster on, how it looks. And uh, there it is. I will say that we can go in here. This is... Uh, Nix is where you can download your mod and this is what they did. This is the original one and this is the new one. Um, male. Male variations uh, down here. So you can see there's much more contrast from this kind of warm tone yellow down here to the cold tone bluish color up here where this is from green to green it still have a light lightness like it lighter down here darker up here it still have a variation the dark uh, old one but clearly this is much more easy to spot however there is also some multiple colorations so it can cheat a little bit you can see here the patterns on the tail have changed. The spikes also seems to have changed. Where here they kind of have this hook feel to it. Some of them where here they look more like small arrowheads. These are also more bumpy looking than these. Uh, I have a different color and the teeth especially looks like they got a rework. You also have a picture here where you can see them again. There's quite a few differences in between here and they look very good. This also kind of look, it looked like some of the color have been robbed off and that's how these kind of scaly crocodilians work. Um, so I really like that. We also have it a little bit here, but I think it looks much better over here. And then we have the female, of course. Um, some of the changes will of course be the same and then we have here for the female also the female but uh, from other sides here again differences alone the, te the teeth are so good over here i'm really looking forward again this is picture that they took where i we will look at it also of course and this is the baby the baby also have a color change and it kind of just looks meaner if you look at the facial features i i can't really spot exactly what it is but this just looks meaner than this um really looking forward for it they have 18 pictures in here we're not going through them all uh, but here you can see you can also get different color, uh, languages if you are spanish korean dutch uh, russian or german you can get that so no danish but i don't even think the da game can go danish um so where did they go we have one over here uh, i think there's only one variation that's new and i'm not sure but i think it may be this one you can see this one don't have the blue color as much up here but have these kind of darker markings then we have this very blue toned one that doesn't have the uh, yellow underbelly this one is much more green uh, so in general there's a lot going on here um i think this one were the one from the picture i think uh superior will of course be the same it is a possibility that there's new pictures yeah i looking at the teeth i actually don't think they changed the pictures but the coloration makes me think they did anyway in general i think they'll look great um he didn't classify which coloration were the new one. I did read the text. I didn't see it. 
Um, but we have a sleeping one here, so let's see. I think the teeth looks more pointy, more sharp than the original. Um, they're in the sand. So right there. I do like the texture overall. I do like this coloration all, all also. But here you also get that idea that it's kind of rough. We have, however, a weird line going on here. And the only thing I can think of is plastic toy that wasn't molded as one piece. So you have these lines where they've been glued together. It kind of looked like that. I don't know how else to say it. And the same here. However, I do believe that the original Soul Water Crocodile also have that. Uh, but I would still wish that the new paint job would have done that. Of course, they did a lot more than just a paint job. Honestly, I think it looks very good. We have another coloration laying over here. I think this is the one from the picture. And that's gorgeous. I think it's a male. Yeah, it's a male. Uh, I'm not sure if any of the colors are gendered. It's shaking in a weird way. Um, I do feel very much like this area is only painted. There's no... You don't, when you go backwards and forwards, this look very flat. It doesn't look 3D at all. Where when you go to these patterns, they actually look 3D. If you can see what I mean, they look very 3D, where these looks flat, which is a little sad because if when you make something 3D and then something in extension of that, that's 2D, then it enhances that thing where it doesn't feel like the same thing um which i think is a little sad i'd rather actually have them go with completely 2d if they couldn't make 3d but since they clearly can i wish that would made a little better but overall they are gorgeous uh, they are of course remasters there's nothing changing the size or the animations or anything uh, so anything should work you can also see here they lie as they should in the water do feel like the eye is very very yellow like from here it's beautiful but from out here it's just look like this little lamp uh, that lights up which is a little creepy to be honest um but overall yeah if you want a more living saltwater crocodile habitat i do recommend these they are quite beautiful uh, another thing is also that they are not a uh, able to deep dive here i think they are able to over here uh, sharks could yesterday so uh, they should be able to hear uh, but as you can see they use all of the water they also use all of the land we have a baby here oh my god i'm not sure if this is something they changed or something i never noticed but that eye is beautiful. I love that. It's very, very beautiful. I really, really, really love that. Um, and again, the texture is really nice. Of course, it looks a little plasticky now, but that's because of the shine. It gets because of the water. I don't assume it looks plasticky anywhere else. I haven't seen a baby, uh, a dry baby yet. Maybe we have some in here hiding. Nope. Um, I know we should have more babies, but maybe they're all in the water. Oh, we have one here. Stop. Ooh, an open mouth and all of that. It's real. I don't know why it crushes fingers. I am not sure why, but it kind of like it. <laughs> um. The flabby feet here, I think it's broke one of the toesies there. 
It looks beautiful. Again, it have a little bit of a shine, but it's not too bad. Like it's a natural shine. It's not a plasticky shine. Um. Yeah, I I said before, it just looks more mean. Like this look like someone that would bully the original. <laughs> but I really like it. Beautiful. Yeah, you deserve a little swim. He's a mean beast. Yeah. Honestly, some of these remasters just really makes me want to go back and build for... Uh, I have animals I have built for a hundred times before. Especially because of the colorations makes a giant difference. For instance, the green original ones they are very monotone but these are easier to spot because of this big color shift from the belly to the top so therefore they are easier to spot in different kind of habitats so you can work a little bit with that uh, which i really do appreciate but again if you do not want to use mats you don't have to and i also understand if you only want to use new species because they're the ones that actually add new things for, to the game but i really think these are worth using the time to at least acknowledge how beautiful they are and some of the animals from frontier do really frustrate me that they look the way they do so i really love that the mothers also take the time to make these beauties and especially if you have a completely modest uh, zoo and then just have one from Frontier, then that one will have a completely different design because Frontier's animals are stylized very much. Um, so to make it fit in better, that's also a reason to do this, of course. Beautiful. I love them. Anyway, guys, that's the last mod this week. And... Uh, Wow, it's only Thursday when I record this the week before. So I am done in good time for once. So that's amazing. So uh, yeah, as always, guys, you know the drill. Like, subscribe and turn on the bell notification. So you know the next time I upload a video. I really hope to see you again. Either in the comments below or in the next video. Bye, guys.